Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel UPSC Self Study. So in this video, we are going to learn about the G20 countries. Just to help you remember the G20 countries in an easy manner for prelims, okay? So G20 is an informal group of 19 countries plus the European Union. So 19 plus 1, 20 G20. And it is a grouping which comprises of world's largest advanced and emerging economies see when we talk about g7 it comprises only of advanced economies whereas g20 includes both advanced as well as emerging economies and it represents about two-thirds of the world's population and 85 percent of global gdp so when we say about world's population it includes both advanced and emerging economies right so and then 85 percent of global gdp it's because of major contribution done by advanced economies and 80% of global investment and over 75% of global trade. So these are the list of countries Argentina, Australia, Brazil, Canada, China, France, Germany, India, Indonesia, Italy, Japan, then South Korea, that is Republic of Korea, Mexico, Russia, Saudi Arabia, South Africa, Turkey, the United Kingdom, United States and the European Union. Apart from these countries, Spain is also there just as a permanent non-member invitee. It just attends every G20 summit, okay, as a non-member, okay. See, just remember the countries continent-wise, okay. Starting from North America, we have canada us and mexico in south america we have only two countries argentina and brazil and coming to europe we have obviously the european union and the countries france uk germany italy and then in africa we have only south africa as a member of g20 okay just remember this and then in asia we have China, sorry, China, Russia, India, then Japan, South Korea, Indonesia, and in Australia, we have Australia, okay? So, here we have Turkey also as a member. See, Africa and Australia have only one country as a member of G20, right? So, and from the west we have these emerge sorry advanced economies as members of g20 canada us mexico and in south america we have only two countries so you just have to remember the asian countries who are all the members of g20 these are all that is when you come to asian when you come to the east this will be the emerging economies that are members of g20 so it will be very easy to remember if you study continent wise if you remember continent twice and this was a question which was asked in upsc prelims 2020 which was held on october 4th okay so in which one of the following groups are all the four countries members of g20 option a argentina mexico south africa and turkey Yes, it is the right answer because you can see from South America we have Argentina and from North America we have Mexico and South Africa is the only country from the continent Africa and Turkey from Asia. So from this G20, from these G20 countries you can guess the G7 countries also because as I said earlier G7 comprises only of advanced economies. So from this list, you can easily call out the G7 countries. Say we are talking about advanced economies. So Canada, France, Germany, Italy, Japan and UK and US. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yes, these are the G7 countries. So, pre from Prim's perspective, you just have to remember the list of countries that come under G20 and G7. Okay, if you study G20 countries, from which you can easily guess G7 countries also. So, thank you so much for watching. Happy learning.